Today, a new class of police officers prepares to hit the streets of Indianapolis. It's part of Mayor Ballard's crime initiative. Sunrise reporter Chris Kirshner is live outside the city county building with what the new recruits mean to the plan to keep the city safe. Chris, good morning. Good morning, Bruce. Yeah, Mayor Ballard himself will swear in this group of new recruits. There are 28 officers in this class uh, who will take the oath to protect and serve the city of Indianapolis. This is the 10th IMPD class, and according to Mayor Ballard's administration, this fulfills his promise to hire 80 new officers this year. It's been a difficult year for IMPD, a challenge to keep enough officers on the streets. Now, there are about 1,560 sworn officers, including the new recruits, but 45 are expected to retire at the end of the year, and according to the FOP, 40% of the force is near retirement age. After a year of violence and the loss of three officers, the mayor has promised a new crime initiative that includes adding more officers to the streets, a job those who make the commitment don't take lightly. Yeah, I mean, it's critical. I mean, because we know that we, we, we would like to have uh, more officers on the street, and part of getting there is making sure that they have the right qualities and characteristics to be successful police officers. I mean, it's not an easy job. It takes commitment, preparation, dedication, uh, and, and discipline. How to pay for those officers went through a lot of debate before there was a decision made. And uh, the addition of officers or whether there's enough officers on the streets will likely be an issue during the next mayoral election. The swearing in ceremony takes place here at the city county building in the public assembly room this afternoon at 2 o'clock. Once those officers are sworn in, then uh, they're also supervised for a year out on the streets. For now, reporting live downtown, Chris Kirshner, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. Chris, thanks very much.